Good morning, people of the grid. <clears throat> it's Thursday. It's my fourth day, fifth day here, I guess. I got here on Sunday. I feel like a local already. Enjoying the food, know my way back and forth. It's quite, quite a nice place. It's nice. There's absolutely no snow. Yeah, haven't really gotten outside much, but um, it is nice. All right, we got two more days to go. Uh, one today, one tomorrow, and then I fly home on Saturday. Totally forgot that I abandoned my Tesla. In 1,000 feet, slight right. But, um, yeah. Okay, I got a turn up here. Talk to you guys in a bit. Hey, people of the grid. I'm done for the day. It was an amazing day. It was actually an amazing two days. I was so busy yesterday that uh, I was so burnt out at the end of the day, I just crashed. Um, but you know what's interesting is, let me bring you up to speed. So yesterday we've wrapped up, I went out and uh, went for a workout, went for a swim, went for dinner, and then I went and crashed. And uh, I think I woke up at 11.30, quarter to 12 at night and I gave Tammy a call, told her, told her I loved her, went to sleep. Today, we spent the day in training and uh, I had an idea. So on the break, instead of running out for the break, I thought, see, yesterday and the day before, we built this presentation that we delivered right on the iPad. I actually did a video, which was easy for me to do because I do it every day. Um, I'm gonna show you a little bit of that here. Hey there, people of the grid. Mike are here, Brew Games. I'm the CGO, the Chief Gaming Officer. I love games like Poing. Check that out. Games like Evil Alien. Check that one out. And of course, everybody loves Digging Dude. Check it out. Biker out. So it was just a fictional thing and, and there's more to the story. I just cut kind of the intro. Had a lot of fun with it. It's part of the reason I was up so late a couple of nights ago, but uh, very, very cool that I was able to do all of that work and capture strictly on the iPad. Today, what I was able to do, and I'm gonna show you that in a sec. Actually, check it out. So this is on my iPad, and this is what I was able to do. Uh, what you're looking at here is a Linux machine. It's uh, just your standard open source Linux machine that I set up and deployed. It's deployed in the cloud. So it's out there somewhere, really doesn't matter where. I've got access to it. I can run stuff on it. I can install stuff on it. I've got about, I think, I don't know, a couple of gigs in it. And uh, it's there. It just lives there for me. And I can manage it and configure it and control it all from my iPad or my iPhone or my Mac or a Windows machine, or any machine, a Linux machine, it doesn't matter. That's pretty slick. And I was able to do this in a matter of minutes. It actually took me longer to figure out how to set up my initial user IDs, because, you know, I've gotten rusty there. It's been a while since I've administered a Linux box, but uh, it's up, it's running, and it's available to do some cool stuff with, like web services, FTP, whatever. I can set up whatever I want on it. That's pretty cool. And I've got a tool now on my iPad called Blink that allows me to access that machine and control it over a slow connection. It doesn't have to be high-speed internet. It could be crappy uh, wireless services like at Starbucks or anywhere. Pretty, pretty cool. It was a fun uh, geeking out couple of days. Okay, I'm heading back to the hotel. I tried to get up early this morning to work out. It didn't happen. You know what it is, is I'm in central time right now and uh, I live in mountain time. So just to, I'm waking up one hour earlier, plus I got to drive in to work to start. So I'm waking up an hour and a half earlier than I normally do. The workout would require me to get up a full hour earlier than, than that. So that's two and a half hours ahead of my wake up time. It just hasn't been happening. So that's okay. I'm working out now. So I'm just gonna pick up a dinner to go. I'll go work out, then I'll eat the dinner. Then I'll be in the hotel room. It's not bad. Tomorrow, because tomorrow's Friday and I don't leave till Saturday morning, 
I understand there's uh, some stuff going on downtown Austin on 6th Street. I'm going to go check that out, I think. I thought I was kind of more in Better Call Saul territory, but this guy, David Comey, the attorney that rocks. Okie dokie then. It's a little different out here. Hey there, people of the grid. Got my workout done, and right now, I'm hanging out in the pool. I'm gonna stay here for a few minutes. I'm reading, I'm at a really good part in the Ender series books. I don't know which book I'm in, the third book. And uh, I'm gonna go eat shortly, but just gotta finish the chapter, and then I'm out of here. All cleaned up, ready to go for supper. One thing I just wanted to tell you guys, I hopped on my iPad real quick. This is pretty cool, because now from my iPad, I actually needed to, to do, because the browser on the Mac was able to download the key file for whatever reason I couldn't do it on the iPad. So I downloaded the key file on the Mac back in Calgary. I moved that up to the cloud, which instantly put it on my iPad here so that I could use it to connect to the server in the cloud again on the Linux side. So now I've got access to a Windows machine back home, a Mac back home, and a Linux server somewhere in the cloud. This is so cool. I, I don't know, it may not be exciting to you guys, but if you're a nerd like me, this is like amazing stuff. It's pretty awesome. Okay, I'm gonna go eat, I'm gonna relax for the rest of the night, and uh, I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow. Training should end sometime mid-afternoon tomorrow, which is awesome. And uh, yeah, Saturday morning I head home. Miker, out. <laughs>